let's take a look at limiting reactants. Each of these flasks has 190 milliliters of one molar acetic acid. How many moles of acetic acid is that? These balloons have differing amounts of sodium bicarbonate, four grams, eight grams, 16 grams, and 32 grams. How many moles of sodium bicarbonate are in each of these balloons? Can you determine the limiting reactant for each flask? Acetic acid and sodium bicarbonate react in a one-to-one -one ratio to produce carbon dioxide. Let's do each of these reactions and compare the sizes of the balloons. First, four grams. Next, eight grams. Sixteen grams. And thirty two grams. In these two flasks, the sodium bicarbonate was the limiting reactant, so it could only produce as much CO2 as it had sodium bicarbonate. This flask, the 16 gram flask, is the stoichiometric ratio, so this is a perfect one-to-one -one ratio. In this flask, the acetic acid was the limiting reactant. These should be pretty much the same because they had the same amount of acetic acid, so that's all that could react.